order wants to create a world currency, a world government, a world army, a world religion. And it's not of Christ, of Buddha, it's not of the Muslim faith, it is a satanic order. I think the most important first thing to say is that a, a policy for a new world order does exist that's often poo-pooed and made fun of in the mainstream press, and yet the reality the is it's there. It's control. Control of our currency, control of our families, of our freedoms, of our religions. They want it all. There's nothing that you have or ever had or ever hope to have that they're not planning to take it away. They want it all. It's an agenda. It is an agenda for the um, centralized control of planet Earth and all its people. Um, where the conspiracies come in is in manipulating that agenda into reality. At the heart of the New World Order conspiracy is the belief that ordinary life is somehow controlled by a mysterious secret society intent on pursuing its own gains at the expense of the rest of us. If this is true, who are these people? And do they really have the power to control our lives? Now, the Illuminati were a real organization that did exist uh, in the 18th century in Europe. They were sort of kind of like the Masons. They kind of grew out of the Freemasonry movement, um, sort of even more secret than Freemasons. And uh, a lot of people think that they, well, they probably did have something to do with the French Revolution and, and that sort of thing. The conspiracy theory would have you believe that the Illuminati have continued to exist to this very day and maybe even existed prior to the 18th century. In fact, back now. The New World Order, it seems, goes back to the very beginnings of civilization itself. When you get back into the ancient world, you find a stunning common theme. Gods with advanced knowledge that created ancient uh, advanced civilizations which modern archaeology and uh, history still cannot explain. These gods, which appeared to be um, of, a, of a reptilian genetic stream originally, interbred with humanity, creating hybrid bloodlines, which were a fusion of the gods and...